guys, welcome to this January layout update. Um, it is the 14th of January when I'm filming this, and a bit has been done on the layout. Um, I know there was, there hasn't been regular layout updates, but that's because nothing has been done pretty much. But my birthday was just on the 11th, and I had an absolutely great day. If you've seen on Facebook, you will have seen what I got, because if you didn't know already, the channel now has a Facebook page. It's called Cruisley Road Model Railway, and I've got like 21 likes on it already, created it on New Year's Day. So, yeah, it's great success so far. So, right. Look at the cows! Yes, the cows. Now, these were quite inventive. My grandma made my birthday cake and on them was a little train track with icing and then like a chocolate train and then she put cows by the side of the train and <laughs> and I didn't know it but these were double O scale cows <laughs> from Hornby and um, very nice little cows actually uh, no, so they're still not in their final position because I'm going to put them a bit out here as well but just on the grass so you can get a a, uh, a feeling of how they're going to look pretty much um, so yeah that is great once I get a little farmer guy with the tractor and the fencing up around here it's going to be great you know I just got some couplings sitting there now new coaches I got for Christmas these are the Hornby BR Hawksworth maroon coaches absolutely flawless I cannot fault them they are just brilliant I am going to do a review on them oh my god look how closely they couple too I've added those um, close couplings uh, that are provided in the box now it looks just right with my BR Prairie as the coaches and the loco are both XGWR flawless absolutely great so you've probably just seen what what I'm heading over to next well before that I just painted a bit more of the undercoat uh, all around there behind the houses and yes another birthday present the Metcalf engine shed still not entirely complete though um, I've got to put the chimneys on and so pretty much if you go back a few videos I did a general update um, and I said there's going to be a Y point in here that is and then but I changed my mind there's going to be a left hand point in there but no I've changed my mind back again <laughs> and there is going to be a Y point in here, just probably a Hornby one because they're cheaper so I am on a bit of a tight budget at the moment and they're going to go into two tracks, I've just got some old track in there just to see what it looks like and um, yeah we're going to have an operating engine chair, there's going to be probably a coal stage, water tower yeah it's going to be great um, sort of marked out I'm going to concrete it with that Woodland Scenics smooth it and paint it not that colour but a grey, light grey colour with you know a bit of overgrown weeds and that's where I get to next but and I've also made this, I finished that last night in the early hours of the morning I really wanted to get it finished put a hole in it, not a very good hole but you're not going to see it um, for lighting so that's good and that just sits there Right, um, static grass applicator. Oh yes, yes, yes. I'm finally going to get one. Uh, my grandma, because they got me, oh yes, um, moving on, they got me a new lamp, which is very good. And they got me, oh yes, a cookbook, because I love cooking. Um, and so they got me that, but the other part of my present was a static grass applicator. And they couldn't get one in for my birthday, like they couldn't get one, so, um, I mean they are going to get one but they couldn't find one in time for the 11th, so I've had to help them a bit and I'm getting a, hopefully, she's, my grandma's going to email me today with, 
what she finds out at the model shop. But hopefully it's going to be a knock Grassmaster, that like one of the best on the market. And as I say, I've got that three one to three mil woodland scenic static grass that's going to go all over the layout. <laughs> well, not all over, but in the places I want to have grass. And so, yep, yeah, that's my grandma and granddad live up north, so hopefully they're going to come down and give it to me. Probably. I, s I think they said they're coming down in February, so you know, just wait for the the updates and the uh, the tutorials. Um, but no, that's great. Um, as you can see, I've just got a couple of steam trains out here at the moment. Got the Prairie and the Hawksworth, and then the two uh, uh, HCC locos with the uh, uh, goods train. And, if I just sit down, um, I've got the latest edition of the Hornby Collector, and if I can find it, they've um, announced their Collector Club model for this year. Now, some people might be thinking, oh, that's, that's really bad, that's terrible, but no, well, I don't mind it, I think it's a really nice model, but what I wish they'd do as I wish they'd, you know, produce a um a diesel like an O six or something. I've already got one of those, but it's nice to see because I like the livery of that and I haven't got the locomotive of that body shape. So um yeah that's nice and they've announced the limited editions exclusive to the Hornby Collector Club but that that is going hopefully what I'm gonna get this year, locomotives wise. Don't know what I'm gonna get at Railex possibly a load of wagons but <laughs> see what I did there a load of wagons no no okay that was a terrible joke um excuse my stupid jokes <sighs> um but yeah I don't know if I'm gonna get a Lima model or like you know a Lima I don't know 47 or 50 or something like that but I want to get some wagons or some stuff so goals for this year um, I want to finish the road and I want to get the backs of the terrace houses because me not living in England didn't help um, that those aren't the proper bits you need the back bit so I'm going to join them together um, I want to get the majority of the grass done I want to get the fences up um, I want to get that area over there sort of all done with the coal stage and water tower um, I want to get this bus stop area finished this probably won't happen until about next year but um, what else did I want to do want to, um, oh yeah we want to build the frame for the layout put it on legs so that will be good rather than just drawers um, yeah and so that's pretty much what I've planned I want to possibly start withering up some wagons um, and yeah get the gardens done for the terrace houses I'm probably saying probably biting off more than I can chew uh, <laughs> but I'm just reading off the sheet that I printed off um, I'm going to get some security fencing uh, to put around the signal box or some of this stuff please comment see what you think um yeah and that brings us to possibly the most epic bit of this year because if you don't know I am recording excuse the mess off a little video camera uh, not a video camera what am I saying um, a Fujifilm digital camera so it's quite good can't really see that oh well um, but so I'm I, I I'm going to get a video camera people oh yes if you don't know what this looks like please type it into Google Images it's a Panasonic V110 I repeat a Panasonic V110 now I hope to get this in a few weeks um, funny story in total for my birthday I got $200 um, but I then realised that when I sold 
some of my Thomas the Tank Engine stuff, I, I got $200 for that. So that's $400. Then I realized the camera's $400. And I was like jumping up and down going, Woohoo! Yeah! I'm going to get a video camera finally! And so I hope to start shooting with that in a couple of weeks. Um, yeah, oh my gosh, you know, I can't wait. So, that brings me to the end of the update, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. Again, comment below with all the progress, please, because I love your suggestions. And, um, I love what you think. So, you know, please, please comment. You know, I, I love it. So, I love reading your guys' comments, and I love you guys, because you guys are so awesome. So, that's it, guys. Remember to please like, comment, subscribe, you know. We're at 85 subscribers last time I checked. You know, 100 is, you know, on the way. Nearly there. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully the next update I'll be filming with my new video camera. So, um, that will allow me to, you know, get really close up. Other than, because that's, you know, that's not very good quality, is it? So, you know, see you guys, have a good day, you know, see you later.